Let's talk about code reviews. This is actually an interesting part as an engineer because whenever you fix something or whenever you write a single line of code, it needs to go through code reviews, which means that senior engineers or engineers on your team that you might be on the same level get to review your code. And this particular point, working as an engineer, is actually one of the most tricky parts because when you do code review, you are not only trying to get feedback for what you have actually done, but also learn from other people. But I see that engineers usually communicate code reviews the wrong way or perceive negative part of code review code reviews are not supposed to be negative you know it's not supposed to be about what you don't know but it's more about you trying to understand what you've done to an engineer that might not even have a contest about what you've done or why you are doing it while you also learn cool new things from other engineers which might have better solution to the problem that you are trying to solve or might have a better idea to what you are trying to do so there are my guidelines for like when trying to do code reviews first of all make your code review as simple as possible the smaller the code there is to review the faster the code review will go because then engineers really understand what you are trying to do because it's actually like small and it's simple and the second thing is to actually make your code review as descriptive as possible because when you actually give a lot of context into what you are trying to do by explaining it in the code the engineer that is trying to review your code will understand what you want to do and you will be able to communicate even faster another thing that i like to do is that sometimes you might actually have to review some large chunk of code what i recommend is that when you open a pull request you actually had comments to those particular lines of code which you think actually have complex logic for example explain what that function is doing and why you are taking that approach and even ask an opinion of the engineer that is trying to review your code like maybe you have a better solution but i can't think of anything this is what i could think of because code review is not supposed to be war between two engineers it's supposed to be a learning phase where you are actually trying to get your work into production and you both learn and you make sure that you are delivering quality code well i hope you've learned something new today and see you on the next one